All right, Ford Ranger, gotta put the battery in it, make sure it's gonna start. I've had the battery on the tender. Um, the biggest problem with this is the alternator. I thought about replacing it, I don't want to, um, but it is a, a pretty solid truck to go ahead and just destroy. Um, so that's what we're gonna do. We are going to test out does a Ford Ranger, and we'll make sure it works fine. We're gonna start it up and move it out of here. Does a Ford Ranger work even if you replace the oil with peanut oil, all right? Some nice, good and gather peanut oil. And if that works too well, extra crunchy peanut butter that we'll put in a bag and we'll squeeze it down in there and see if that makes some noise um, and see if we can kill the Ranger um, tonight. What brought this on? We don't know, but we're gonna have some fun doing it. So we're gonna run it, get the oil hot, drain the oil out, and then uh, we'll start start filling it back up. The outside handle's broken, so you gotta, gotta keep the window down all the time to be able to get in this thing. All right, strong battery, fire it up. Oh. Just leave it in gear. You're safe. That's professional. Go ahead and warm it up a little bit. Professional thinking right there. Oh yeah. Gotta get the oil nice and Oh, dude. That's a nice oil. Why is it like already milky? That's what I'm wondering. Didn't even abuse this Ranger, dude, honestly. All right, that's all the oil. Out, bolt tight again. Yeah, with my hand. Ready to go. We'll grab the new oil. Hand tight. Boom, boom. Takes five quarts, so it'll be a little low, but What's the point in doing it if you're doing it right? I think this oil, yeah, is gonna do way too well for what How we want it to. Oh, oh. Valve clearances. Oh, yeah. oh, nice. We're gonna be cooking tonight. Good to go. Zero W3. <laughs> That's like what we were saying earlier. All right, big question of the day. Can you substitute your engine oil with peanut oil? Okay. Probably could have some head gasket issues. We're going to start up just fine. This will start just fine. Oh, the noise is gone. <laughs> yeah. Clean running truck. Now let's go sell her on Facebook. <laughs> oil change. Let's go flip it. Just a waiting game now. Oh, the oil. Oh yeah. Mighty dandy. How is the oil pressure doing good? We're a quart low and using peanut oil. That's the one that I'm most worried about is if uh, the battery dies. But then uh Temp, holding. Uh, hopefully, we have enough gas. Hopefully, we have enough gas. We'll see. I'm gonna get some peanut butter ready. Okay. So here's the plan. You gotta put the peanut butter in the bag, and then you snip one of the corners, and then you just squeeze it all down in there. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, suction. Yeah. Nice. It's like a typical sun 
Sunday morning, peanut butter's empty, dog's bloated. <laughs> 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 oh no. Let's see where the tent's oh, at. The Are they hot? <laughs> oh, oh no. <laughs> where? <laughs> oh baby. Holy oh, crap. On the phone? What is this guy even doing? I think we broke the timing belt. Ah, that would make no, it wouldn't be turning like that. Oh, maybe, is that just a starter? Hey guys, we got a problem. What's up? Problem. You gotta probably look underneath there. Specifically the oil pan. You think? <laughs> what happened to the cover? Dude, I don't think that's metal. That's, no, that's, those are peanuts. Extra crunchy <laughs> peanuts, dude. Oh, they are. We're roasting peanuts up in here. Yeah, that's your issue. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh no. Something in between here and there is not not right. I wonder if we broke the timing belt or if see the timing belt still taunts. Give me your light. So we found out Snap. you may not be able to swap your oil with, with peanut butter. We're diagnosing still. We don't know. Take this off and then get a uh uh what is that? Probably like 18 or 19 or something, try to turn it. You just want to get this out of there. Boom. <laughs> Easy removal. <laughs> <laughs> if we can break this free, I bet we get this thing running again. I bet. Not big enough? Oh, there we go. Yeah, we'd have to get it like back in time. Do the... oh, shit. I don't think we actually need to do that. I'm having me a party. The camp shaft talking to the crank. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I can go. <laughs> <laughs> you have to push the clutch. No! Oh, oh man. I think that was a valve hitting the piston. <laughs> it's fry, all right, though. Nope. Chain's up there. Hammering away. He'll knock it backwards, and then I start it to roll it back forward, trying to get it freed up. Oh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, Oh, that's a sticky spot. All right. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hold on. I feel like we had someone with like a little hook on it. We could just hook it in one of these holes and just use the leverage on the top and just crank her over. Yeah, this thing's fucked, Miles. Off with the mirror! Because <laughs> we could see exactly what's happening with our valve train. The old quarter trick? Yeah, we'll do the old quarter trick. Time for the die. Oh, dude! We're dude. speed racers! <laughs> <laughs> it blew it close. <laughs> it de-latched and then re-latched itself. 
<laughs> the stink. Not even that bad. Jesus. Not even that bad. Yeah, that's a little dusty. That's about it. What huh. a backfire. Nice. Look at the dash. Yeah. I mean, look at the windshield, just all fucked up. I know. Oh yeah, dude. Spidered it all out. That is amazing. <laughs> oh, look at this, Miles. Oh, it pushed it out more. <laughs> it was already broken, but it pushed it out. I'm not even gonna what? touch that. Oh yeah, there's glass right there. I like the echo. I think that. it's cool. No, I'm gonna go. the bed. Gotta love being in Mexico. That's the end of the Ford Ranger.